Today we're talking about Kovi Coin, a new project we discovered and we'll talk with you guys today. As always, do your own research to figure out if this project is for you. So Kovi Coin is a utility token in the healthcare space. So we're going to talk about everything about this project. We're going to talk about what's coming up uh, in the near future, some of their latest updates, and then how you guys can get involved if you're interested in investing in this project. So let's go. Here on the website at covicoin.org and right off the bat i like to say that they've done a great job with their website uh <laughs> i know this doesn't uh speak about their project but i just do like the fact that look super professional they put a lot of time into this they show the price uh that's currently at they make it really easy to find all their socials and information um how to navigate the site so i thought they've done a really good job and for me uh, i think this is important especially uh when you're bringing in new investors and they if this is their first impression um, of your company and your project, uh, I think it's super important. So kudos to them there. But let's learn about this project. So uh, the 100x altcoin for healthcare after much anticipation, Kobe Coin is now launched. Join us in ushering a new era of unprecedented in fairness and transparency for global healthcare. Uh, we'll check out the community and we'll ch I'll teach you guys um, how to buy if you guys want into this project. I mean, they have a bunch of people in the Telegram that are constantly uh, excited about this project and the possibilities. Um, and right here, uh, I appreciate them. I'm not going to click on all of them. Uh, there's a ton of articles, but the amount of exposure that they're getting, I think is great. So let's check out this Market Watch article. I thought it's really great exposure for this project. It says, launch of an alternative healthcare currency, Kobe Coin, currently launched in mid-September 2021. Uh, and they talk about that it is uh, the principal currency for Project X. And then if you guys are wondering what Project X is, it has an up-and-coming unified global framework for healthcare systems. Uh, so I think it's great. And they obviously talk about the utility of this project. But I think what's the important thing that they're featuring and talking about is that uh, this project is designed to reward frontline workers. Obviously, we're in a pandemic. Obviously, COVID is obviously a huge issue. Uh, and so it's great that this crypto project is doing things to actually make a huge difference. Uh, and they talk about um, gifting Kobe coins to frontline workers, etc. We'll deep dive into that in a second. But it's great having this uh, with all the news going on. It's great to see all this positive stuff, not only in the cryptocurrency space, but just uh, in the healthcare space uh, overall. So I thought that was great, and I kind of wanted to, um, you know, uh, talk about that because I thought that was great. Um, so again, let's talk about this. Foundational phase. A soft launch was conducted on 19 September, and with 9% of supply, a prelude to a primary launch in 2020, alongside the rollout of Kobe Hub. So a lot of interesting things. Uh, will be a foundational phase to bring out price stability and encourage long-term investment in the project, which we'll learn. Uh, global adoption. Uh, creators the answer to come some of the most deep-rooted issues. Kobe Coin will bring fairness and transparency uh, throughout the uh, healthcare industry. And then, of course, we talk about rewarding frontline workers, which is great. Uh, in 2021-22, we'll be gifting 5% of the circulating supply to 10,000 frontliners globally. Again, I don't think anyone's going to complain about them giving this. I think uh, we should be doing anything possible because it's really the frontline workers that are making a difference. They're the ones out there um, every day. Uh, I sit behind a computer uh, <laughs> talking about uh, interesting projects. So anything that I can do uh, to help uh, the people that are out there making a difference, helping others, I think is great. So uh, that's awesome. Um, which we'll learn more, more about that in a second. Investor-centric tokenomics model. So Kobe Coin, their symbol is CVC, will be created with initial supply of 10 billion and designed to efficiently sustain its price to promote loyalty uh, through a 10% transaction fee. We'll talk about the fee in a second. The diagram shows the default fee allocation, although there'll be slight variations. So they're saying uh, this will mainly be the percentage breakdown, but there'll be some uh, logic where it'll change depending uh, on the price and things like that. So. 4% reflection in BUSD. So we talked about rewarding frontline workers, but how about rewarding us? So getting that in BUSD, a stable coin is awesome. 2% buyback, 1% growth, 1% charity, and 2% auto liqui liquidity pool. All great. All things that I think is important to maintain uh, a growing stable project. So uh, I appreciate that. And I do think, again, uh, I like the roadmap. Looks really cool. Um, I do think it's great that they're being super transparent with you guys. Um, because of the fact they're showing you guys what they're doing, uh, where the money is going, where the investment's going, how, how your rewards um, are being allocated. 
but also they're talking about the roadmap and saying everything that's coming along this project. So uh, a bunch of things. <laughs> um, so complete. So starting up, they've already done first government link up. So they're working uh, with government agency in the Middle East. Uh, so giving you guys update on that. So soft launch is talking about initial push. Um, uh, and then this Q4 is uh, really a two-pronged campaign will be targeting new and existing crypto investors. Again, they're marketing this. They're talking about this. They want to make sure that you guys know what they're trying to do. And then obviously being listed on exchanges to make sure that once you're interested in this project, that you can buy it on whatever exchange um, that you know you typically use. So BitMart, Hotbit, Gate.io, so a bunch of uh, places you can buy this. I'll teach you guys how to buy it and where you can buy it today. Um, but it's great that they're trying to, of course, there's a global... Um, project and so they want to make sure that it's accessible and easy to acquire no matter where you are so uh, that's great faces behind uh, Kobe coin we'll learn about that uh, right now um, so the team team with diverse experience on blockchain finance humanitarianism and marketing uh, and they talk about their founding members who's a part of this team what they do the type of experience that they have and without taking too much into this they have a lot of experience not just in crypto growing projects Definitely in healthcare, and just really, um, you know, I think it's important. They have brought on a bunch of people that know what they're doing and know how to scale a project, and um, you know, I think it's good. They obviously have a great vision that they all share, and I think that's important. Like I said, especially in the world that we live in now, they having a positive message, positive vision, and rewarding the people like the frontline workers um, who deserve it, I think is great. And then they talk about, you know, having people from uh, different parts of the globe uh, that give their perspective on what makes a successful project and providing the expertise and really having a person uh, in those places like Singapore and the UAE that could really help uh, push that project um, from, their, uh, from their country standpoints. So I think it's good. Um, cool. So let's just jump right into some of these things. I know there's a bunch that we're, we're trying to cover today. Obviously, we'll check out their socials on their Telegram and things like that. Um, but uh, I just want to make sure that everything uh, gets addressed uh, as much as possible. So they have frequently asked questions for you guys. If you guys um, are interested about this, they talk about the contract address, when it's been launched, things that they're trying to do, etc. cetera. Uh, also, they have some information uh, for the frontline workers, right? If maybe if you're a frontline worker, if you know someone who's a frontline worker, um, you want to know uh, how this project relates to you uh, and then what actually Kobe coins can be used for. Um, they want to be able to have this token be a main uh, utility token for uh, the health industry. So they talk um, about that uh, and how they're continuing to build on the utility of that. And then how, if you want to claim your 50,000 Kobe coins, how you can do that. They have a sign up process um, for that. And they talk about eligibility. Uh, and again, these are the frontline workers, the ones that are making <laughs> our lives, my lives, your guys' lives um, able to function uh, in a crazy pandemic uh, without much disruption. So healthcare first responders, of course, but even people like food and grocery workers who didn't get to, um, you know, work from home. They're out there every day, uh, you know, dealing with this um, more closely than you and I. Central services and sanitation workers. So if you guys are eligible, there's ways for you to sign up uh, to claim. Uh, and again, learn all about that um, on the website uh, if you guys want to. If you guys are interested in, in if you're an investor and you guys want to jump into this project and you believe in this mission, believe in the team, uh, you buy it on PancakeSwap, uh, this is the uh, contract address. Make sure you're grabbing it from this website. Again, they give this website's Awesome. They even teach you guys how to buy it. Create a crypto wallet, trust wallet, mobile phone, add Kobe coin to your wallet, uh, buy Binance, BNB. I have a video where how you can get BNB uh, to your uh, wallet. So whether it's trust wallet or MetaMask, and basically you swap BNB for um, Kobe coin, CBC, and uh, they tell you uh, what to set your slippage for. They said 11%. Um, it should be all good. Make sure that, again, you're buying the amount that you're trying to buy and you're buying CBC. But it's relatively easy. And of course, they have more free ask questions if you guys get stuck. But very easy process. And I appreciate them for teaching guys um, how to do that. So they have more information if you want to learn about the tribute to frontline workers and everything that they're doing here and kind of like the vision uh, behind this. Um, I think it's great. And obviously, this is like an ongoing thing that it can keep pushing. And, um, you know, like I said, they want to just keep pushing this project for healthcare. Obviously, we're in a pandemic now. 
everyone expects things to obviously get better, more people get vaccinated, everything will be good. Uh, but I think it's really preparing people for the future and for, uh, you know, long term healthcare. And, you know, in case something like this comes up in the future, hopefully it doesn't, but that we're uh, as prepared as possible. And then the frontline workers are as supported um, as needed. So you can learn more uh, about that as possible. And again, if you're a frontline worker, you can sign up. Um, and they obviously talk more about their phases, their foundational phase, their background, their tokenomics, all the initiatives that they're working on, and then obviously their initial push, um, which started literally um, a month ago, but they have accomplished um, a lot and everything that they're trying to do in order to really push this project and get it to the next level. And whether that's getting initial investors, spreading the word, or just holding it patiently and, you know, uh, falling for things on the roadmap, talking about this, um, you know, really interacting with the community and doing your part uh, to, um, you know, uh, get this project to one cent. And they talk about what that's going to take. It's not only going to take investors, it's going to take partnerships uh, with governments and health cares. It's going to take you guys in the community to really um, push and do everything you can from a marketing standpoint, uh, from a word of mouth standpoint. Uh, I obviously think that when they launch things like the Kobe coin, it's definitely going to help uh, get more eyes on this project. So, Project's very early on, not financial advice, but now might be a, a good time uh, to jump in. If you want to check out the white paper that talks all about this, uh, you definitely can and kind of like uh, what their plans are for the future and uh, talks about, you know, really how the utility of this token is going to be pushed uh, even further. So if you guys want to learn more about this, we'll check out the DEX tools um, right now. Uh, and again, they launched uh, back in early. Um, this took, Remember, they started like in September was their initial push, uh, but we're looking at um, early October here. They had some initial growth. Obviously, you got to all-time high. People started selling. They started leveling off, and it is, um, you know, starting to pick up back again. But for your early investors, it might be a good time to jump in because of all of the exciting things that are still coming. Um, I think obviously they're getting a lot of press with them giving to frontline workers. I think when more frontline workers realize that they could get a uh, free Kobe coin uh, for signing up, uh, I think that's great. And a, a bunch of interesting things. Like I said, very early on, they're trying to um, establish themselves as the main token for healthcare. And with everything coming up, like the Kobe Hub, etc., uh, I think more and more people will be uh, jumping on this project. So, might be a good time to jump in. Obviously, do your own research. Uh, follow them on Telegram at Telegram Kobe Coin Official. Uh, almost three, over 3,000 members. So I think that's great. And check out their Twitter for some of the updates that are, uh, you know. Uh, coming. I do think that there's a lot of people that are interested in this project, constantly being on board with it. And, you know, definitely um, check this project out. Obviously, their listings on CoinMarketCap and CoinGecko raised the price, but now that their price is starting to stabilize, I do think that it's going to continue to grow um, at a steady pace. So definitely um, check it out for yourself and uh, do your own research. Again, great mission, great team. They're audited, their team is doxxed. So you know that they're in this for a long run. And like I said, they have a great mission that I think we all could stand behind. So definitely check it out. I'll put a link in the description. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this project, their vision, the team. Uh, I think it's great. I think you guys uh, will get a lot of um, value from investing in this, being a part of this. Uh, so definitely check it out. So kovicoin.org. Uh, thanks everyone for watching. Catch you guys next time. <laughs>